This is West Ham unofficial. Come on, your irons. Welcome to West Ham unofficial. Bit of a pre match drive. We are making our way up to Old Trafford. I'm here with Gary. Gary, how are you? Morning, Jake. I'm good. Are you? Yeah, not bad. Early start. Very early start for me, <laughs> very early. five o'clock start. Yeah, yeah. So we are making our way up to Old Trafford, a bit of a pre-match drive, it's match day. Um, how are you feeling? Confident, confident as always, so I'm looking forward to the game. Hopefully we can uh, turn up. If we turn up and play well, I think we can win because the fans will probably be quite nervous at Manchester United. They've had a bit of a niffy run, so I'm confident the Hammers can do it. Yeah, let's hope so. Uh, Man United, we're going up here today. We're hearing that the, um, Ronaldo might be iffy whether he's playing. Do you are you are you coming up here fearing Man United? No, certainly not. I mean, the last time I came out was a few years back and went under Ferguson, and you'd pray you get away with that a, th a thrashing. Nowadays, no, I feel I feel quite confident. I think we can certainly get at least a draw. Yeah, we've we've had a week's rest. Man United have had a few days rest. Um, do you think that plays into a factor of how well we play today and bounce back after that disappointing performance against Leeds? Hopefully, yes, and hopefully Zuma's back. Yeah. So that'll be good. Suchek, I'm not quite sure, though he's over COVID, that'll be good to come in. We've heard that um, um, David Moyes said on his press conference that Suchek is back from COVID. He was being assessed yesterday. Zuma, we haven't really heard anything on, but we expect him to be back. That's massive for us. Absolutely huge, because he's, he's, he calms the other centre back down as well. A bit of Dawson or Diop, he's, he's excellent. So if Zuma plays, I honestly think we will do okay because if Ronaldo's not up front, I guess they'll play Cavani maybe. Well, we've heard Cavani's injured as well. They got like they got Greenwood. They've got Alanga on that left-hand side who's really come into his own in the last few games. I mean, they got a few pacey players and they got plenty of players to bring off the bench. Sancho, Jesse Lingard. Jesse Lingard. <laughs> just just luck if he comes and scores again like he did at the London Stadium. That would just just our luck. Yeah. But no, I'm feeling confident. If you're not confident before the game, when are you confident? So. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Back four or back five today? What do you reckon Moyes will go with? Um, I think probably history says he goes for a back five against the big teams away. So I'd be surprised if he doesn't. He'd probably play Cresswell at the back of the three with hopefully Zuma and Dawson. And then uh, Cress on the left. And I personally would bring Ben Johnson in on the right. I think he's, he, he played well uh, earlier in the season. It's been a bit unfortunate to be dropped the last couple of games. Yeah, I think so too. Um, of course... Who's our who's our key player? Player. I mean, Bowen's on fire, but any other key players for us today to make sure we get a good result? Obviously, Declan's massive. You know, if he steps up, I thought he's, he was good last week against Leeds, and if he can con control the midfield against McTominay and um, Fred, which I think he's better than both of those, I think we've got a chance to uh, to get something. And it's just as you say, Bowen's on fire. Uh, I don't think Ben Rama's back. He's, he's still well. Well, yeah. I wouldn't. Ex I wouldn't, I wouldn't expect him to start, but don't be surprised if he's on the bench. Yeah, and we've got Lanzini. Yeah. So I think, yeah, I'm feeling confident if Deck, Deck has a good game and control the midfield. Uh, with Zoomers at the back. Suchek's coming in. You know, we've got a good chance today. Mm, yeah. Um, got the likes of... Um, it's, it's difficult because, you know, they've, they've got these really good players, but their defence is where they're lacking. Do you think Antonio's licking his lips at the likes of Lindelof and... Yeah. Maguire, Varane today? Yeah, I think so. I think Antonio will, will push him around, I think. Maguire came off the bench, if I'm not mistaken, midweek. I'm not sure what's happened to him. Mm. But Lindelof, he'll, he'll, he'll go straight over Lindelof. Yeah. And uh, Varane, as you say. And wan has had a funny season as well, but I'm yeah. not sure if he's playing. So I'm, I think they've got not got a solid defence. De Gea is a good keeper, but I think I was fancy to score, because we always score. Yeah. Manchester United's uh, key player today? Um, that's a good question. <laughs> I'm trying to think their key player. Because I, I fear their pace, to be honest, at the back, if we're not careful. Dawson's very slow. So yeah. Greenwood's quick. Rashford's quick. Um, so if they expose our pace, that's what I'll be worried about, the, the two quick wingers. Yeah. Um, so other than that, that's my only, my only fear. So hopefully Moyes will do something tactically to cover that. Um, and we'll be okay. Maybe bring, you bring Ryan Fredericks in or something. Yeah, let's hope so. And a quick prediction before we go. A solid 2-1 victory to the Hammers. Who's going to score? Uh, Bowen, because he's on fire, of course. And then uh, Lanzini. 
love it. Thank you very much for watching. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to West Ham Unofficial if you are new. This has been the pre-match drive as we're making our way up to Old Trafford uh, to see West Ham versus Manchester United. So uh, we're looking forward to the game. Match day vlog will be to you tomorrow morning. So uh, without further ado, I'm going to let you go. Thank you very much for watching. Come on, you irons. Come on, you irons. And we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.